What's up, Keep Pounding crew? Back today with another video. Keep Pounding! We are pre-game for the Atlanta Falcons in Bank of America Stadium. If you like the video, if you like the channel, hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that bell, select all, leave a comment down below if you feel like doing so. Let's dive on in. So, we're looking at a possible win here today against the Falcons. Now, I, I feel like it's going to be a replicate of the first time we played them because they haven't gotten much better. Uh, you're still looking at an offense that's still struggling a little bit in a secondary that is still exposed. Uh, so the only difference in this game is we're going to have Christian McCaffrey. Now what that means is we're going to have a rushing game. So that's something we didn't have last week. For whatever reason, Mike Davis got stopped and that running game got abandoned. Uh, which ultimately led to a couple of dead drives for us against the Saints. Now, defensively, we have cut Eli Apple. And we also cut wide receiver Seth. So, what that tells me is that we are making room for Christian McCaffrey to come back off the Andrew list. And possibly for a couple of new signings. This is not, ladies and gentlemen, a message from Tepper or Matt Rule saying that we need to get ourselves back together and play better. I, no, I don't think so. The fact that we are where we are record-wise and what we have done progress-wise should be a testament to the fact that we are playing better. And the fact that we came within three points to tying the Saints, that tells me that we are right on track to where we need to be long-term wise we are right on schedule uh for a chance for nine wins possibly 10 at the end of the year i doubt we'll get 10 but right now we're looking at nine um if we could split with the saints you know that last game of the season we could be looking at nine um so here's what i think is going to happen Gurley's going to run circles around our defense again uh, Calvin really is going to turn up a little bit this time. So we're going to have to keep a close eye on him. Uh, Julio Jones will get limited again, you know, on yardage. I don't think they're going to go to him this time around. They may change it up. We'll see. But, uh, as far as I know, Douglas is still questionable. I still have no idea what's going on with him. So, we'll see how that goes. Um, but, for right now, we're looking at Troy Pride Jr. We're looking at uh, Zach Kerr, mainly, uh, at corner. And, I think, you know, with Zach Kerr coming back in, things are going to get interesting. I, I predict that we'll get a sack against Matt Ryan today. I think that offensive line is still average for Atlanta to below average. Our pass rush will ramp up a little bit more. That should be the goal today is our pass rush. Um, we need pass deflections as well. That's our second goal for today. Tackling, as always, is number three. Um, and I'm going to set this as another fourth goal is work on our pass protection you know not necessarily the run blocking because christian mccaffrey will find holes for himself that's not a concern but let's get some pass protection in this game because the saints pass rush was very very potent you know they're a lot more dangerous than you think they are so give them the credit that they're due that's a strong pass rushing team it may not look like it numbers-wise, but you could tell by the way that they were brushing our, our uh, average line. Average to below average line. You know, theirs is way worse than ours is. So, keep that in mind. I think we're going to get a sack. We're going to get uh, at least five hurries today. And I think we're going to get a couple of pass deflections from uh, 
Jeremy Chin, and possibly a linebacker as well. Probably Shaq. So, uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Matchups-wise, they may change it up from last time, but I doubt it. You know, um, Atlanta's just in a train wreck hole right now. And the last time we played them, we got the coach fired, so... <laughs> That was a sweet, sweet moment for us. So, I just want to say, we got a chance to sweep Atlanta. We got to do it. We've got to do it, folks. This is our one chance at redemption from all those years where we struggled against Atlanta. This is it. We need to take advantage of it right now. Today. With that in mind... Keep pounding. Let's go get that W.